welcome back. Hot air balloons and fireworks already lighting up the sky tonight. Yeah, big time tonight. Thousands of people gathering out there at Coney Island for the annual 4th of July celebration. And that's where we find WLWT News 5's Rachel Hersheimer live with the sights and the sounds. And there were many, Rachel. There were Mike and Cherie. This was such a special evening here at Coney Island. People traveled from near and far to watch the 23rd annual balloon glow and the fireworks show. And everyone we spoke with tells us tonight did not disappoint. It's where memories are made. I think it's really cool to be here and see everything. At Coney Island today, thousands of people are soaking in the sun making a splash and competing for a souvenir. All right, young man, you get any prize on the counter. As the sun goes down, it's the main attraction, leaving everyone on the edge of their seats. It's a family tradition of ours. We've come like every year for five years now. So yeah, excited to be here. The 23rd annual balloon glow is a sight to see. Paul Dover popped in from Denver to check it out. We actually were Googling what to do in Cincinnati today, and it just happened to be this. This celebration is more than a yearly attraction. It's about putting smiles on kids' faces. We want to help mom and dad uh, show the little loves of their lives what it's like to be a kid in the height of summertime. Not to mention the endless food options on the menu, from refreshing snow cones to classic funnel cakes. There's something for everybody. I mean, you're not going to leave hungry, and hopefully you'll leave very happy. As the sun sets, the last act begins. A firework finale over Lake Como. It's the icing on the cake to a perfect evening. And that's what we're all about here. It's families and fun and memories all together. It's a lot of fun in that you should definitely come out here to see everything. The fireworks show that ended this evening was just spectacular. It lasted about 15 minutes, and a rep with Coney Island estimates that more than 10,000 people showed up tonight. We're live from Coney Island Park. Rachel Hersheimer, WLWT News 5. All right, beautiful story there, Rachel. Thank you, and we're helping you find other fireworks shows all around town. Just scan the QR code on your screen right there. It's going to take you to WLWT's list of Independence Day parades, festivals, and fireworks shows. Those events have links listed by date and neighborhood as well.